Nuxt today is one of the most popular ways of building view apps. I saw that Nuxt Labs got acquired by Vercel. Yeah. How is the relation currently with the view team and the Nuxt team? So the relationship really didn't change at all. Obviously, everybody, when they hear about an acquisition, what they worry is, oh, is the evil company going to squeeze them for money and try to force every Nux user to deploy on Vercel? I think that <laughs> fear, at least for now, has proven to be unwarranted. So I was pleased to see that basically when I clicked on the deployment section on the Nux documentation, I got suggested with various deployment platforms and not only Vercel. Yep, there was yep, like definitely. 20 yeah. of them. So that was I was happy to see that. I've actually talked to Sebastian, talked to Daniel about the acquisition after, afterwards. So I think Vercel is keeping their words. Vercel actually is very explicit about their intention of the acquisition is they want to diversify. It does not want to be viewed as the company that only supports Next.js. Because Next.js, while being their biggest lead generator, but Vercel is the framework agnostic platform. So people will argue, say Next.js has like platform locking, blah, blah, blah. But Vercel as a platform, right, it supports everything. It supports everything. all the frameworks. Mm -hmm. And it wants mm -hmm. to support Svelte, it wants to support Nux, it wants to support Beat as well. Acquiring Nux actually is an attempt to show people, hey, like we actually support different frameworks. 